whatever coach says, and like <laughs> that makes you start to kind of dislike them because it's like, why, why are we doing this for one team? So basically, a negative motivation constantly. I mean, kind of, but then you don't really understand until you actually play how intense and how much every play matters, and and it's it's gonna hurt. It's gonna be dirty. It's gonna be grimy, but I mean. That's why we work so hard, just to overcome that. Obviously, the other side of the ball than where you play, but were you somewhat surprised with how your offense played against Michigan's defense in that game last year? No. I, I was I was never surprised about my, our offense because I, I was expecting us to score every drive. Mm -hmm. But, like, the way we played as a defense, I was just very, very proud of. But that was that was one of the highlights of my, my season, for sure. How do you guys balance like working towards that game every day without like looking ahead each, like during the season in mm -hmm. particular, without like overlooking opponents while still getting ready for that rivalry game? Yeah, I mean, it's it's not like we don't talk about any other teams, <laughs> but I mean, we just emphasize that one because we know how much it means to the state of Ohio. We know how much it means to just everybody in Columbus in general, like to our families, like, and it's bragging rights for a whole year too. So. I mean, we, we know how much it means, but I mean, we've we've messed up a couple of times over the past couple of years too, just losing games we probably shouldn't have lost. So, I mean, we understand how how important every game is. Are you terrible at Fortnite? I I am terrible at Fortnite. <laughs> I am. Cause you gotta play to get good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't I don't play. So me me and my me and my friends. Uh, We'll get on like maybe every once, once like every like three months or something. And then like maps will be completely different. And like we'll be like, what is this? And then we'll just get killed. But if we win, like we're like running around hallways, like, yeah, it's like, it's fun. Because if you don't know what you're doing, you jump, you dive in and you get killed like in 10 seconds. Right? Yeah. But like what we do, we just hide the whole time. Like we'll, we'll we'll find a bush or, or something yeah, like that, yeah. and we'll just hide. Yeah, be the bush. Exactly. Yeah. You gotta be the bush. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so we'll just we'll just hide the whole time. We got lucky a couple of times where we like found a bush, and then like the storm just like we didn't have to move anywhere like the whole game, and then ended up killing at the end. And we got first. But, yeah. Did you lead the team of tackles last year? I think me and League tied. Yeah. I think. Should a safety, or is that like some kind of indication of? Maybe some things aren't going right, or, or like, yeah. like, do you want to lead the team in tackles? Like, would that be a goal this year, or, or? Uh, I do. The linebackers probably don't. <laughs> but right. I want to lead the tack team in tackles. It's like, that's cool. But uh, I would say like, the kinds of tackles I was making weren't like the best, or the, and they weren't like highlight plays. So like, it wasn't great for us. I would say. So I would much rather lower my tackles than uh, have the team suffer. Jordan, how yeah. much different is the atmosphere on the defense of the side of the ball and, uh, and those rooms this year with all the diff uh, new coaches this year as opposed to last year? Okay. Yeah, it's a, it's, a, it's a bit of a different vibe. I mean, I mean, we had great coaches last year. Um, coach Shiano is one of, the, one of the best coaches I've been around. Uh, he, was, he was my specific coach for two years, and he was just a D coordinator last year, but he was a great coach. Coach Grinch is one of my favorite coaches, for sure, that I've come across. Um, but this year, it's just a different vibe and in a different scheme as well. Um, so that's what I like. Guys are having fun. Guys are playing with swagger, confident. So, yeah, it's good. Do you think it's going to be most improved uh, in the secondary this season if guys are turning, in your opinion? Um, look out for... I'm 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 very excited for Jeff Okuda and and uh, Damon Arnett. I'm excited for Sean. I'm excited for for B White. But also look out for Isaiah Pryor and Josh Proctor, Jocelyn Wynn. I, I can name everybody. <laughs> Seven Banks, Marcus Williamson, Amir Reed. Literally everybody. But yeah, yeah, I'm I'm obviously biased towards my guys. So. Coach Hackley's been very successful in recruiting. What do you think it is about him and your opinion that makes him so successful in that area? Yeah, I would, I would just say he's just real. And you can tell, like, if he cares about something, he, he like, truly cares. And he, he doesn't care about the fluff. He just cares about real relationships and just real facts. So, I mean, 
his facts speak for themselves. Um, he's a great guy and a great coach, very knowledgeable. And just sitting down and talking with him, you could just get that feel. And, uh, 